What is going on? Tennis Live, condition of the Call of Duty Black Ops 3. Join the game video. A little bit about Combine right now. Well, when Black Ops 2 was first released, I was playing Combine quite a bit. Right? I was playing it left and right. Hardpoint, Domination, Free For All, Gun Game, Deathmatch, Safeguard, Uplink, you name it, I was playing it. Combine was by far my favorite map when Black Ops 3 first came out. I haven't played it that much recently. We've been playing a lot of game battles and quite a bit of Free For All on maps other than combat so i'm actually pretty happy to be playing this gun game on combat right now and i decided you know what let's go ahead and make a video so right now i'm three and one off to a decent start have the shotgun in hand usually i get hit marks with this thing hopefully i can get like a one shot kill or something looks like this dude next to me may have the dual akimbo rk5 i don't know why i always say dual akimbo on this thing it's just akimbo all right He's bad, he missed. I got the kill. On to the next shotgun right now. Some dude right next to me. Bang! Hit fire for the win. On to the haymaker. Ooh, this dude behind me got the kill. Apparently he was on the silent shotgun, the KRM. But since I do have a shotgun, I'm going to go into this building right here and hold it down. I got a shotgun, but I was able to get the kill. Someone's going to spawn in the back. I know the spawns on this map for gun game because I used to play it so much. But anyways, I'm going to be coming in here with a fair pre-aiming this door. It looks like the dude ran off towards the middle. On the map. We'll see if I can pick up the kill at some point or another. But anyways, last week I uploaded a video where I played gun game on the map Nuketown. In that video, I ended up going 20 and fire. I think that was the second or third best game I've had of gun game here on Black Ops 3. I know my best game was on Fringe where I ended up going 20 and 2, alright? 20 and 2. That was my best game so far on Black Ops 3. I'm going to be trying to beat that eventually by going 20 and 0. If I can go 20 and 1, I feel like that's kind of pointless. I might as well just try to go 20 and 0. So I may try to do that challenge sometime on my may try to do that challenge sometime in the future on my channel here on YouTube. But as for this video, I'm gonna try to do better than 20 and 5. So right now I'm 11 and 2. Got the M8 in hand. This guy might rush me. He was in front of me. Gonna use it to tag him and bang. Went to the Shiva now. I always say the Shiva is my least favorite weapon here on Black Ops 3 because you cannot control the fire rate. Like you, if you can shoot it at a consistent fire rate, right? Which I mean, it's okay. But since it is a one burst weapon or one bullet per pull of the trigger weapon. You would like something that you could pull as fast as possible, like the foul from Black Ops 2 or Modern Warfare 2. I've been chilling back here in the back of this base here for a hot minute. Haven't seen anybody until this dude right under me. Can I get the hit fire kill, please? I really don't want to aim down and sight the Shiva anymore. And now I'm onto the door. I'm looking for the hit fire with the two bullet light machine. I'm able to get that kill. Someone's going to be rushing me. I have another light machine gun in my hand. Uh, where's he at? All right, that guy's on the Gorgon. That guy might be in second, actually, because he had the Gorgon. That's what you had after 13, or that's what you had after 12, so that's what you had after 13, so it is your 14th kill. He's rushing me now, he knows where I'm at. He's still on it, he's still on it. The yellow and green camouflage guy is on the light machine, and I believe that guy is in second, because I am in first. I hear someone boosting around me. Oh, I didn't, I don't feel like I missed that shot. I missed that one. Bang, get him with a headshot. All right, now I just gotta sort of camp this corner. I know the spawn. Someone's gonna spawn either in the back and run to me, or they're gonna spawn in this alley to my left. So I'm sort of boosting right now, waiting for the spawns to be in my favor. They actually spawned off to the right and ran at me, and then I wasn't able to get the kill. Someone spawned behind me now. Bang! With the rocket launcher, I'm able to get the kill. Someone's chasing me now. I'm 18 and 5, right? So I'm gonna get these next two kills without dying if I want to do better than that Nuketown game I had last week here on my channel. This guy has a rocket launcher, I'm able to stab him. And then, oh, that guy, he's on the KM44, so I'm not going to do better than my video last week. Still a respectable game here on the map combo. I don't know if I already said this video or not, but whenever you play a play gun game on a smaller map, it's more difficult to have only a few deaths just because Okay, I'm gonna be good. Just because everyone spawns so close together, you'll be reloading if you shoot too many bullets, or if you're switching weapons, someone may be right next to you. If you have gunfire on the map, someone's gonna run directly to you. So small maps are always more difficult in gun games to have a few amount of deaths. But if you take a look at the screen right now, I only had six deaths. The next closest least amount of deaths was 13. So that's more than double what I had. So I did pretty good this game. Able to go 20 and 6, winning the game on Combine. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. New videos are going to be here on my channel. Good luck. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video.